Yeah, he has a freaking machine gun. And it's like, it never runs out. It's really hard to hit him. And he does follow you. Somehow, somehow he knows where you're at. Probably not the best spot for this. <laughs> that door is just like made of like impenetrable steel or something. Uh, if you can, when I Alright. Managed to get him uh, without getting hit. Which is a good thing. And he did tear up this wall like, pretty good. Um, so those like those marks like stay there for like forever. I guess. <laughs> Alright, let's go get our our prize. Which is just a just a key, really. Yeah. Tore up this place. Just bullet holes everywhere. We got the gallery key. So Yeah, it does a pretty good amount of damage. Um, we didn't get hit, which is great. It's like the best possible way that we could have that I could have done that. <laughs> like run, and then like shoot him as he's uh, getting ready. But uh, also, if you ha if you should have the uh, special weapons, just use those. It's locked. Well, I have a key. All right, this room. Just another puzzle. Yeah, just just another puzzle. Uh, basically, the sacrifices of six lives try to make way for the true path. So basically, what these specters are are, are people dying. Um, one is a guy about to get his head cut off. The second one, uh, going from left to right, is like the crucifix of like Jesus and the two thieves, and the two on the right are just people being hung. So. This is like the easiest, easiest puzzle ever. All you have to do is press each button, each number once, in any order possible of any combination of four numbers. Um, so all you have to do is just press each one one time. So like you do one two three four four three two one one four two three one four three two four three two one whatever combo you want two four one three whatever. 
So I'm going to do three, um, I don't know, two, four, one. And press OK, because the only, the point is to have six people dead, or going to die, or uh, going to die on the pictures. So it's a total of six, six people. And there's only three pictures, so it doesn't, doesn't matter if, if they're repeated or not. So, so the pictures equal three people, like one going from left to right, one, two, three, four, five, six. So there you go. Pretty simple. It's very easy. in surprise but I'm afraid it's Ashley we need not you mr. Kennedy if you don't need me then get off my back old man <gasps> did you say old man mr. Kennedy it might come as a surprise but I'm only 20 years old so you're just like all the others a puppet of the parasites surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados the parasites, las plagas, are slaves to my will. I have absolute control. Well, I really don't give a damn. Rain or shine, you're going down. Get rid of our American friend. Oops. <laughs> Did not mean to do that. Um, press the minus button a little bit too early. I, was, I ended the cutscene, but whatever. Oh, look out! Yeah, those guys. Uh, I think they're are they new? I don't know. Um. All right, so we got rid of those fools. <laughs> Um, yeah, the guys with the scythes, they... Um, oh, look out! You got rocket launchers. Yes, please. Um, so they throw their weapon at you. Um, they can cut your head off in one hit. It's kind of lame, but... I guess, I don't know if it like, makes sense? I don't know. But, uh, yeah, they can do that, so be careful. Because you don't want, want your head to be chopped off in one go. So, uh. Let's so chill right here for a second. Popping heads like candy. Alright. Sir? Alright. Get rid of you. right here for, for a second. Oh jeez! Did not even see your arrow, wherever you came from. Sir, 
Get over here. Oh, fuck out. Like, did a U turn on me. And this is where those new dudes with the rockets came from. Nice. Y'all need to quit moving around. Jeez, quit moving around. Um, I'm switching to this because. Boom! <laughs> yeah. You can uh, get those guys. Um, oh, you. S what the heck? Where the frick did you shoot me from? Alright, got those guys. They don't always die from fire, but. Sometimes they do. Like three of those, or there's like two? Two or three of those guys died from uh, getting burned. So. Looks like a security system of some sort. Deactivate. Alright. I think we're safe right here. Yeah. Spinel. Which one to do here? Um, since we can't get to that centerpiece, like we can't jump over. It's too far. You have to go into this little corridor and then uh, break that. There's a switch. Press it. Yes. Makes that appear. And uh, all you have to do really right here is just uh, op open the door and then back away because there's going to be like two dudes with rockets. And uh, yeah, see. I don't know why they just, like just wasted their rockets, but whatever. Not gonna complain about it. Candy number one. Candy number two. <laughs> All right. So now we can go around and uh, claim our prize. We got the goat ornaments. Basically, what this was or is is a. Uh, I think there's like a whole bunch of dudes that's supposed to come out. But uh, I don't see them. Whatever. I thought there was like a whole bunch of like other dudes that are supposed to like appear. Um, I guess not. Handgun ammo. And this door, um, it's locked from the other side, but uh, Leon will just keep kicking it. So uh, in here we have uh, nothing just a bunch of, bunch of birds, which I mean, you can try to shoot if you so please. But uh, birds aren't really 
that really um, they're not not a threat to you. You can try to kill them, but they fly away too quickly. To be really um, worth anything, I, I never really try to kill them anyways. This part coming up is another part that uh, nobody likes. Also, also right here, um, there's a fountain. It contains a whole bunch of birds. Um, I actually am going to try and kill all of the ones here. I wish I had a flash grenade so I could just kill them all in one, one go. But I don't. Alright, bird number one. Bird number two. Bird number three. Alright. The only reason I did that was because... They drop a good amount of money. So, I mean... Might as well get the extra money. It won't open. It's locked from the other side. With a little help from another person, I just might be able to get in from up there. Yeah, um, in there there's a broken butterfly um, for free instead of just buying it. Um, you need you need uh, Ashley to actually go and grab it. Um, I tend to forget that's even there because once you get Ashley, you uh, just continue forward. You get on normally backtrack or you don't normally like loop or go back, go back through another area um, like in the village so Herb. Let's mix these. But um, yeah. Um, if you care to get the broken butterfly, I mean, the powerful gun, very powerful actually. But you don't get that much ammo f for it. Um, but it it is useful. Oh man, this is the area I was talking about a second ago that nobody likes. Uh, I forgot how long these chapters are because I've been recording for like about an hour already. Um, so there's already like another, a previous part where I uh, was like recorded, recorded for like 90 minutes. It won't open. There's indentations here. Two moons make one. Um, but, uh. Yeah, um, hold on. Mr. Kennedy. Still alive, I see. So, do you like my garden? I see you've managed to work in a little of your twisted taste here, too. <laughs> Sagacious as I am, even I get lost here sometimes. Even if it takes your whole life, you'll never get out. Do you know that no one dies without a cause? You will satisfy the stomachs of my cute pets. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to tie up a few loose ends. Like chasing down a couple of rats. Two rats? If one's Lewis, who's the other? Huh. They're an intruder besides me? Yes, Leon. There's another person going around here. But, uh... I'm not gonna worry about that right now. But yeah, like I was saying, um... I've been recording for like an hour, and I have a previous part, or previous chapter, really, that was 90 minutes long, so I'm gonna have to split that into like 
two 45 minute parts. So, I mean, these go up on Saturdays. So, um, um, I think people can watch those more or have more time to watch those on the weekends than like any other. So, I think, uh, I think having long videos um, is is fine. I don't know. I mean, like, I can't understand like during the week, but uh, on we on weekends people have more time to do stuff. Uh, so yeah, this area is a big giant maze. It, it's full of like these dogs. We saw in the village by the by the church for the first time. That was the only time that we saw them. And now they're back in this maze area, which sucks. <clears throat> but um, yeah, it's really not fun. They jump out at you. I'm trying to figure out which way to go first. Oh, gout. Leon! Yeah, they can somehow open up, uh, go through gates. I'm not sure how they do that, but whatever. <laughs> and they can um have like these these like tentacles that like come out of their back. Which really sucks too. There's the just the rest of the old gate. Alright, so that must be that must be, I can't even talk. That must be the one that I'm hearing right now. Um freaking out on me. Yeah, see he's like <laughs> he's got the shakes. He's like freaking out. Is he gonna bust through the gate? I hope not. Yeah, I think um, <laughs> it's like uh, uh, I want him, but uh, yeah, he can't. Get to me. Can you just die, please? No, he didn't drop anything. I don't have to worry about going over there. She's totally fine with me. I think uh, every time that you grab something, these, I don't know what you even call them, just like dogs, like wolf dogs, I don't even know, parasite dog things, 
they jump out at you, but not, not 100% on that. I'm not really 100% on a lot, a lot of stuff on this game, even though I've played it so many times and beat it so many times. It's a fun game. Enjoy it very much. Like something that's always different. There's something like changes or not necessarily changes. Like something is always like the way it plays out is different than uh, the previous time that you played it, or if you like, you know where stuff is. Um, Let's grab this right here. First aid spray. Thank you very much. Turn around. I think especially when you grab something from a chest. Um, they will jump out at you. Oh, I guess not. It's not in this one. You can. You can like faintly hear them talking, or not talking. Dogs don't talk? You can faintly hear them like growling at you, or at me, I guess, in the background. Ever so, ever so slightly, just to keep you on your toes. Okay, you can jump out or not, or not. Guess not. I know one's gonna jump out right here because it's it's a long hallway, a long path. And I know one jumps out right here. I guess it's like the obvious points. The one jumps out at you. Nope. Yeah, that was obvious. Try to scare you. I don't want to go over there yet. All right. So this is the yeah, this is the fountain. This is one of the uh, moonstones. Are at the right half of the moonstone. Um, there's like a whole bunch in there. I'll take these guys out real quick. And yeah, they're pretty, pretty mean, mean looking. Alright, I don't know why these other ones didn't move. Alright, that's just, just the uh, money. I mean, I can go without a couple, like, hundred or Thousand, but if it's like ammo, then I will try harder for it. Like, where did I come from? I think it was over here.
So I don't know why that one um, decided to run past this. How do I get... I think it's this way. Yeah. Yeah, okay. The red gem. Another treasure. Once we got another elegant mask, we can just do that. Like before. Since we killed those other ones, um, they're in here, they're not gonna bother us. When he disappeared on me. Right, I think this just goes to another part of the hedge maze. Alright, we got shotgun shells. It's always very nice to get very nice to get more ammo. So we're gonna go across here and go over to this fountain. That's where the other moonstone is. And you can wait, you can just combine them. Yeah, okay. I think we might we might be able to place them separately. Nope. Alright, y'all need to die. That was the most intense part of that of this area so far. Um, kind of funny, funny that TMP ammo is in this area because there's a wolf on there, and you're like fighting dogs. I guess I don't know what they even called. All 
I think that's it for these. So we now we can leave. I'm pretty sure that's that's everything. Nope. Yeah. Well, I didn't didn't grab the treasure map. So, but I'm pretty sure I got the, the one only treasure really. So, uh, yeah, we got through that pretty easy. We, we did like walk through the whole thing pretty much. That's like the best way to do to do that. All right. Since we have this. Dang it, no. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. Huh. Bit of advice, try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. Leon. Long time no see. Ada. So it is true. True? About what? You, working with Wesker. I see you've been doing your homework. Why, Ada? What's it to you? Why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> See you around. Ada! Alright, so. <clears throat> kind of a long chapter. Um, so we got through a whole lot. Fought a whole bunch of enemies. Uh, hit ratio 81%. I think that's like the lowest we've gotten so far. Um, down to 89. Not too bad. Enemies killed 59. To 388 total. We have have yet to die. I'm trying to keep that to a minimum. To zero. That's my goal. So. <clears throat> So yeah, guys, uh, thank you for watching. Make sure to comment, rate, subscribe. Or comment, rate, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time for more of Resident Evil 4. Bye!